Hello, I'm Rodney Booth, and I'm the owner and operator of the Country Corral and have been for over 20 years. Running a business is like riding a bull. You never know which way it will go. Unfortunately, things don't look so good. And so after a couple of attempts of doing something different with the club, I've decided to try the corral once again. So jump on the bull and sit back and watch the remaking of the Country Corral in King, North Carolina. Rodney's just playing. Rodney just plays what all the... What everybody wants to hear. Right. Well, Rodney plays what the customers are going up there requesting. But, you know, you do know that, you know, tonight is the first night that the, the reality uh, show is starting to film also. So, you know. Well, they're starting a YouTube reality show. So if you come up here, you know, you'll have to sign a waiver to be filmed. <laughs> Goodbye. God Almighty. She said that if you if you go to any hip hop club or any rock and roll club anywhere in Winston that they're going to play all hip hop or rock and roll and never hear any country. But if you go to any country club anywhere in North Carolina, you would not hear any Snoop Doggy Dog, or that you would hear all Snoop Doggy Dog shit. Did I say that? Hi guys! Hey! What's <laughs> up? What are you doing tonight? <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming out the TV. <laughs> oh, he was amazed by the TV. <laughs> he up? couldn't keep his eyes off of it. <laughs> what did he say about it? He said, so where'd you get the TV at? I said, someone gave it to me. Well, I've never seen a TV like that before. Show the TV. <laughs> it's a Tommy Page special. And I said, I bet you that thing don't work, does it, Tommy? Got a great picture on it. <laughs> showing it at a particular shop. <laughs> <laughs> Ethiopian child. <laughs> so what happened today? Well... I never harmed a soul. Christina asked to go and get hay, of course, you know. But Who are you talking about? Christina asked to go and get hay today. Uh-huh. So, we go in the pick of truck. She says we're supposed to be on the particular road. And so I call Mark and tell we're on the way. We're sitting down there. I pull in, not realizing that, you know, I came back out and there's snow all over the place. And so we get stuck. <laughs> well, we keep sitting and sitting and sitting. Nowhere to go. And then finally Mark calls me and says, hey, where you at? We're sitting here stuck up. You got a chain? Yeah, I got one in the back end. I said, okay, go. You got to pull me out. Well, why didn't you just call him and tell you tell him you were stuck? Well, because he said he was on his way. So we was waiting. He was at the other place. Because he thought we was going to the old barn. Not on Ziggler Road. So he gets there and he says, well, my chain ain't long enough. I said, well, why are we just screwed? I <laughs> a tie-down strap. Well, is it big enough? Well, yeah, it'd be big enough. We pulled it out before us. So we get the tie-down strap and then we uh, look up his chain. And so and then we proceed and I said, uh, you got four-wheel drive? No, just two-wheel drive. I said, well, then we're just really going to be screwed. So, we finally keep spinning, he's spinning. We finally get the truck out. We park it in the driveway and I back all the way out because it will not turn around, no work. Tell us what you the whole story of that deal. Tell us Aaron Boy, otherwise known as a defense attorney. John Buchanan, I represent Mr. Skaggs. Well, thank you for looking like Napoleon Dynamite through that whole entire <laughs> Can I have some tots? <laughs> Hey, dude, give me your tots. <laughs> no, I need the camera on you now. So. Here. Give me your tots. Here. <laughs> give me your tots. <laughs> Where are you going? Let me bring him in here and ask him to do the story again. Recreate.
create the story. I didn't know. Tell me what it happened, and he'd probably recreate, recreate. It'd be more dramatic than before because he knows the fucking camera is on. Shit. I don't need another jello shot. Alex, your baby's barely alive. I doubt she's going to leave the hospital. I'm listening to a day I'm back on the streets. So I'm ready. Okay, we're ready. Hey, um, y'all got any more batteries for video cameras? The extra batteries? The one up on the bar is about out. You got to be kidding me. No. <laughs> Actually, no. So anything else happened out there? No. Not a lot. Putting on what they're doing there, huh? Okay. Yeah. They just stop it right there.
Once again, thanks for watching the video of the Country Corral in King, North Carolina. Be sure to join us again next time. Tell all your friends. The Country Corral in King is a place to party.